tonight on Winning Astro. Add strength, more space wine. The space station gets filled with fucking CO2 or something. Adds struggles with a screwdriver. And he drinks more space wine. Right. We're back with a shite telescope. Um, I'm going to show you some issues that I have already. Um, first of all, back down on Earth. Down it's over there, actually. Um, it's winter in the UK, which is where I live and where my spaceship lands. And it's cloudy 99.999% of the time. So, I haven't been able to try this. First issue, just take this bit out. Shite camera doesn't fit. Solution, take it that bit off. Shite camera fits. Shite camera falls out. So I could put shite camera in, crimp it down a bit, or tape it. But what I'm going to do is drill that out to make that fit there. And then I can use this little clanky bit here to hopefully secure something on. First issue, shite camera on the floor. Second issue, I want to pick the shite camera up. Let's put the shite camera up here. Right, second issue. This is a Celestron Sky Prodigy mount. So, I am planning on using this track the moon there's an issue my duck down duck tail every time I'm going to run I'm not drunk this time there's no space wine in here the duck tail clamps as tight as it goes shite telescope does not stay in so we need to put a dovetail on here coming plan There's a dovetail. I will take it off of here, put it on here, right in there. Get back to Earth, wait for a clear night, and uh, try and take a photo of the moon that's sharp. And it's a down leak again. I'm pretty sure it's an OCO2 leak or possibly. Uh, most of the oxygen, but as you can see, it gets kind of uh, kind of foggy in here. And every now and then, it purges some something. Anyway, try to let's go. Right, change of plan. I found a dovetail. Well, actually, I took it off of another telescope, or not actually a telescope, a camera lens. So I took it off of that, and uh, we're going to mount it. To this bad boy and we have space wine now I raided the space wine cupboard found space wine so let's try a telescope let's move some shit out of the way like this right shite telescope has two screws by the looks of it which I will unscrew with this uh, space screwdriver but that's what's gonna go wrong when we do this well, for a start, the screws don't come out. I'm going to say that they're bolted in. I'm taking this part off to get to the screws. That's where I lose the screws while we have an artificial gravity failure. Because we keep on getting CO2 leaks. Let's 
three screws that hold this bad boy together. Will it come apart? Will it come apart? Oh, it comes apart. There we go. There's a couple of nuts in there. So. Oh, look down there. Yeah. Don't know if you can see down there, but there is a couple of nuts. So I am going to remove said couple of nuts. Probably drop them on the shit lens that's coated, but we don't know what coated it's actually got. Um, I'm going to say probably shit. Right. That piece of shit is off. Um, I reckon that will fit on there. We just might need to make the hole in here a tad bigger. With a screwdriver, not the correct tool, to try and thread this in. Right. Will this work or will it not? Who knows? Tad bigger. Just enough to get this started. That might start feeling more unlikely, but it might. If it feels good, which it probably isn't, click the thumbs up button. If it's shite, Click the thumbs down button. If you're ready to fuck up and never make a YouTube video again, fuck off yourself. Right now, we still need to make the hole bigger. I should probably get a drill. But that would then involve going all the way to supply module 1287. And we can't be bothered to do that. Right, we need to get the thread in. Oh, we've got a thread started. Didn't have a thread started. Oh, come on. We have a bit of an option to make the shoot. Well, it's a hope. Yeah, we'll see how to work. 